Hello, dear shopkeeper. One sword, please. Oh, sorry, but your bank balance says empty. Really? No sword for me? Not even payment in good jokes? Haha, <laughs> sorry, but here we don't accept payment in bursts of laughter. Let's get started to make some money. Oh, it's you again. Yes, I finally have enough money to buy the sword. All right, here you go. Thank you. Now hand it all over. No. <laughs> No stress. I'm always here for the tutorial. Let's go. Start by creating your shop and add a counter to it. You can check out my other video to learn how to make one. Place a gear part on the ground. Place a button and connect it to the gear part. Connect the button number 10 from your counter to the button. For my second item, I'm adding a speed part, but you can choose what you prefer. Add another button, but this time connect it to the speed part. Create a small system to validate the two buttons on the counter. I use two invisible blocks, a push part, and a button in the middle. Connect the button to your shop button. Adjust your system if necessary, and remember to set the can collide property of both basic blocks to false. Connect button number 20 and button 5 to the basic blocks. Create a button to make the counter button invisible and connect it. Create a basic block and push part on your button and connect the counter button to the basic part. Transform the counter button into a token. Create another system to reset everything upon purchase. Add a basic part, a push part, and a button stacked on top of each other. Connect the button to the three push parts of the counter. Connect the shop buttons to the basic part of your system and set can collide to false. And add a deactivator button. 